All right, first off, I want to say we stayed at Getaway West last year in Catskills, and it was great. It was amazing. It was wonderful. So, of course, we wanted to come back. We decided to try out Getaway East. So that's the new wing, the new section of Getaway Cabins. Uh, the first time we went, they had great quality control. It was just amazing. The, the views were amazing. The cabin was amazing. It was a great experience. Unfortunately, we feel like they sort of fell short of the mission this time around. Um, I did a review on Google Review in which I mentioned that I'll make a video. So this is the video. This is the review of Getaway East in the Catskills. And it is now August 5th. We stayed there, I think, the 2nd and the 3rd. And our cabin was Barton, which you'll see right now. So we just arrived in Getaway House. We'll be here for two nights. Got our little fridge. Books. Bunk beds. Not the greatest view. Sometimes you get ones with really good views. This one's okay. A little table. A little bathroom. Wait till I show you how the bathroom works. Very interesting. Very interesting. You're gonna like it. I mean, not a big deal. It's not a really big deal for us um, that the door, that the bathroom door doesn't close. It's just sometimes like taking a shower or going to the bathroom where you might want the door closed. And it's just like, if it's late at night or something, you're not gonna close it because you'll wake up, you're just gonna wake up someone if they're sleeping. It was just loud. Again, wood warps, I get it. Maybe it's just our bad luck, but it is what it is. The first morning after the hike, we're both still pretty sore, but not too bad considering. So these guys are actually doing a really great job, um, you know, moving the dirt and digging up everything. We're just surprised to see them out our window this morning, on our, our first morning here. It's just a little surprising, right? Definitely. A bit contrary to the mission. We put our pot up here for now because we won't be using it because... Yikes. Ew, seriously? That is so gross. So basically, my girlfriend was gonna cook something in the pot. We got the pot down. It was gross, as you saw in the video. So she immediately texts the person. You get a welcome packet, and there's a name and a number. So you can text the person if you have any issues. So she texted the name and number. She texted the number on the packet and said, we didn't have cards. We didn't have a deck of cards. They have a book that shows you uh, a bunch of card games. And last time, you know, we loved it. We played cards. This time, there was no cards. So she texts them and said, oh, we'll get that. We'll get the items right over to you. Great. Awesome. Not a problem. So a few hours go by and we're like, all right. So she texts again. This is maybe like two and a half hours later, three hours later. I don't know. It was a long time. And uh, the response was, oh, uh, I just got word that we don't have any more pots, but the cards will be dropped off immediately. So, you know, about 15 minutes later, I walk out. They, they sent a text and said the cards are at the cards are at the end of the driveway which I went out and got the cards appreciate it it's just I don't know it just seemed like if we didn't text again it then then we wouldn't have probably gotten either again maybe I'm wrong maybe it's just our bad luck but I guess it is what it is I totally get it, work needs to be done. Maybe it's just, again, our bad luck that we happen to go when they need to do work 
right in front of our cabin, like on this on the on the road. Maybe that's just our bad luck again, but you know, not really doesn't seem like it's it's um I don't know. So this is the road in. This is our cabin. But this is what I mean by in the middle. So we have one there. We have that road. One there. One there. Those are the outer loop. Those are the ones that you want. And you have one there and one here and so this is where that first cabin I mentioned in my in my Google review there was a cabin when you turn on the street there was one right smack in the middle so that cabin is gone and now there is they're doing something over there I don't know what and this is our our back view it just feels like the ground has just been dug up and trees have just been like dug up and it's just not quite finished there are a lot of great things about getaway house we really really do like it and I don't know how soon we're gonna want to go back but this time just wasn't a great experience but I mean the bathrooms and everything are updated uh, it's really cute. It's really, the cabins are really, really cute. It's a really fun experience. Um, it's just that we had really, really rotten luck this time. And there's just some quality control things that could have been, could have been helped. Um, one thing I will show you at the end is that when we say last time, they had re these really cool, like futuristic uh, toilets that are really kind of weird, but like amusing, or not amusing, like fascinating. So stay tuned at the end for the futuristic toilet.